Little mama her thoughts, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag. Pull up to the spot, living too fast, driving and driving the stash. doing today welcome back to my channel my name is Don Marie and I am a transgender youtuber on this channel we talk about transgender issues hormone updates all that jazz and we do like story times of crazy things that happen in my life and I'm, yeah if you're new here welcome to my channel we all love you here we're an accepting family and if you've already been here welcome back I love you. And if you haven't subscribed, that's a problem. We're gonna have to fight. I'm gonna need your fade right now, right here. Because why you viewing these videos, honey, and not subscribing to my channel? We're gonna have a serious problem. You need to subscribe. So today, I'm excited, so excited for this topic because it's just, for all my sisters out there, for all my sisters, if you're feeling down, don't you dare, girl, because this video is gonna pick your mood up, bitch. This is going to pick your mood up. Today we're going to talk about the reasons and the benefits of dating a transgender woman and why we are probably most likely, I don't want to be biased, but why we're probably most likely a better candidate of uh, dating than like, you know, your average bish. The first reason being, we are strong, strong individuals. We've had to endure a lot you know, within our life, and we've been through a lot, and it just makes us stronger people, and it makes us really sweet. You go through as much as a trans woman who's been, like, either kicked out of her home, or she's been beat up by people, by bullies and stuff. She's gonna be a very, very loving, caring person because she doesn't want anybody to feel what she's been through, you know? So she's gonna be super sweet and she's just gonna be a loving person. Number two for why you should date a trans woman instead. I'm just kidding. We are more appreciative of the small things. We don't need you to, like, you know, go buy us an expensive lunch or, you know, spend a hundred dollars on something for me to be happy. We just want you to like hold our hands in public. We just want you to be happy that you're with us. Like, you know, little things like holding our hand in public can make us super happy because, you know, there are people out there that want to hide us. So, you know, we're we're easy to please. We don't we don't have like super unobtainable like standards. Like we do have standards. Not gonna I don't wanna make it sound like we don't have standards. But you know we we are not just like stuck up and like bougie and just wanting the world from you. We just appreciate the small things. Get it where I'm living. <laughs> Number tres. Oh no 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 I wanna say that in Spanish. Numero tres. <laughs> Number three for why it is beneficial to date a transgender woman is not all guys wanna have kids. Believe it or not, right now I'm talking to a guy who doesn't want to have kids. And that's where I actually got this little pointer from. Um, you know, we can't get pregnant. Which means we don't have periods either. So a lot of guys don't want kids. There's so much pressure to have a kid when there's a guy and a female, you know, in a relationship. There's like, oh, well, now hurry it up. Like, we want you to get married, have some kids, you know. Not all guys want kids. So, you know, if you don't want kids, we're the perfect candidate for you. Like, at first I was like, hmm... You know, maybe I'm, I'm sad because I want to have my own children too. But, you know, whatever. Like, you know, I'll, I'll keep my body nice and toned and fit. And, you know, keep it stretch mark free. You know, I do have stretch marks on the side of my booty because it's growing. I would say number four would be that we know a man's needs more than your average girl. The reason that being is because we've been on the other side, if you're catching my drift. Number five, hope. I feel like number five is because trans women are more feminine and make more of an effort. The reason that being is, is because we're making up for what we for what we lacked in our previous life and you know we care about our appearance and we just want to look spruced up and feminine at all times.
Guys love that. Guys appreciate it. I heard from a few guys that I've dated, like, you know what, like, I really appreciate trans women because they actually take the time to get ready and don't take advantage of being a woman. Oh my god, this hair is getting on my nerves right here. You guys actually, like, take the time and effort to be feminine and to be girly, and you guys aren't trying to, like, step all over our toes all the time. Feminism nowadays, I swear. You guys are like, well, you know, girls want to be a girl, but want to act like a dude. It's like, you can't be chilling over there with the dudes and trying to act like a dude, but expect him to treat you like a woman. No, honey, that's just not how it works. So sorry to break it to ya. It's not how it works. My hair is just not agreeing with me today. We're just gonna... Okay, bitch, you need to stay, there we go. Finally, last but not least, I'm sure that I can come up with more reasons um, for why it's more beneficial to stay a transgender woman, but we are more accepting, come on now. We're probably the most talked about group, minority, and made fun of group ever. We are super accepting because we know what it's like to be picked on and to be judged for being different. So it's like if a guy likes something different, like, you know, we're going to be like, hey, like, kudos to that. We just genuinely accept it for what it is. We don't judge you. So if you're a little weirdo and you are afraid that a, an average girl will judge you, hey, whatever. You know, mm -hmm. that's pretty much it for this video. If you ladies are feeling like really, really down and you feel like you're not gonna ever be worthy of a man, trust me, trust me when I tell you, baby. Yes, you are. You are enough and you will one day find a love. Don't ever let anybody tell you otherwise. There are all these girls in the comments, I swear, I receive, the more my channel grows, the more hate it receives. Like, these females are, uh, like aggressive like they say like you'll never be a real woman you'll never have know what it feels like to have a soft pretty vagina girl girl one day one day i will don't worry my doctor's gonna make it nice and tight so it can please my man every day uh -huh. <laughs> a lot of women just think that you're being a woman is um defined by being able to have a period and by being able to get pregnant and reproduce it's like no it's not because a lot of guys don't want kids, one. And it's like, if you're saying that all you're worth is being able to have a child, then honey, that's a problem. It's a problem. It's a super problem. And that shouldn't be what defines your worth. And if that is what defines your worth, I'm going to pray for you. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I hope you have a good night or day, wherever you are in the world. Don't forget to share this video. Subscribe with all your friends. Share this video, you know. <laughs> I'll see you guys in my next video next Tuesday. I love you guys so much. Mwah.